I love my pizza oven, but I've never dreamed of making an artichoke pizza before. Mm. Not a globe artichoke and definitely not a Jerusalem artichoke. This is really different. Well, being a tuber like a potato, one of Marco Pierre White's favourite pizzas mm. is the potato and taleggio pizza. It's one of, so this is a little bit of a play on that. OK. OK, taleggio would, would mask the flavour of the Jerusalem artichoke, and we really want to capture that. OK. So we've got our pizza dough ball, which we made earlier. I always find it better to make your dough the night before. Okay. Don't let it prove before you put it in the fridge. As you can see, it's just expanding on its own. And you're not, you're not needing to roll this out here, are you? I'm not going to roll it out because you end up with lots of air bubbles on the side and no crust. Yeah. OK? If you hand turn your pizza and if you've made your dough right, you'll end up with that beautiful little crust there. Make it nice and round. You'll notice that we've got that beautiful crust. If you've got any holes, yeah. just fold it over and press it down. OK. Creme fraiche, a little bit like sour cream. OK, it's got a nice little bit of acidity there to it. You don't want too much, OK, because you don't want it to goo everywhere. If you go over the edge in a wood-fired pizza oven and you're not using a tray, it'll stick. It'll right. stick okay. to the bottom because yeah. that moisture there. OK, some fresh thyme. Yep. Fresh from the garden. We picked it this morning. Some lovely local mozzarella. Now, when you say local, this has been made local. This is made in Victoria Park. Right. Yeah, yeah, very, very good. Very new guys started out. And when you use something from a local producer, he's bought his produce from a local farmer. Yeah, yeah. All right, Jerusalem artichokes. I'm not even going to peel these. Right. We've dug them up this morning. I've given them a good scrub. Yep. And I'm just going to shave them on my mandolin and I'm going to hope that I don't cut myself. Yeah. And I keep looking at you while I'm don't, doing no, it, right? Don't, don't, don't. <laughs> Look what you're doing. OK. So, now, like the yakun earlier on, these yeah. will oxidise quite quickly. That's why I'm doing them last. OK. Yeah. So, about two artichokes. And all we're going to do is lay them around. Nice, even coverage. You can see they're starting to go brown already. Straight away. Just like that. And we're going to finish with a little bit of salt and a touch of olive oil. There you go, Trev. That's all yours. Straight in? Straight in. OK. Now, we should give that a quarter turn, about every 45 seconds to a minute, depending on how hot the oven is. OK. So we are ready to go here. Want to do the honours, Trev? Oh, OK. Nice, thin base, good crust. 